Hello friends, today we'll learn about maps. Haha, <laughs> you're doing your morning workout here in the park. See this park map? It tells you where you've been, where you are, and where you're going. A map is an illustration of an area such as a city, a country, or a continent showing its main features. Hmm, it's a drawing that gives special clues about an area. The word map is originated from the Latin word mappa. That means a paper or napkin. These were the materials the earliest maps of the world were drawn on. The history of mapping can be traced to approximately 5,000 years ago. Guys, this is the Imago Mundi. It is considered the oldest surviving world map. It was found in a town called Sippar in Iraq. The sun rises in the east. Stretch out your arms. Your left hand is now pointing east. Right hand is pointing west. North is at the top and south towards the bottom. This is the map of the world. North is at the top, south at the bottom. This is east and this part is facing west. These are called the cardinal directions. You can easily see which country or continent is in which direction. Different places are shown with different colors, so we can easily locate a particular continent. Usually, countries are shown by dots and capitals with a star. There are many types of maps. Let's see the five main types one by one. General Reference Map These are simple maps showing important physical features, both natural and man-made, in an area. For example, see this road map? It shows the roads boldly and using road widths and colors to distinguish between major and minor roads. Thematic A thematic map shows a single attribute, such as soil type, vegetation, land use, geology, and land ownership. Hmm. For example, this French Guiana map shows the vegetation areas, the rainforest areas, Westland forest, marsh, and savanna. Navigation charts or nautical charts. It is a map that characterizes the configuration of the shoreline and sea floor. It gives important information about water depths, locations of dangers to navigation, locations and characteristics of aids to navigation, and many other features. Topographic maps. These maps are a detailed record of a land area, giving geographic position and elevations. They show the shape of the land, the mountains, plains, and valleys by means of brown contour lines. Cadastral maps. See this cadastral map? It shows the boundaries and ownership of land within a specified area. This type of map may also show drainage, culture, and other things relating to use of the land. Can you show the map from this park to your home? This road map is an example of general reference map. So many places are there on the way. See, there's a school, a hotel, a restaurant, and so many other places. Now you know a lot about maps. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.